happiness can mean very different things to different people. The countries with the happiest immigrants are not the richest countries, but instead the countries with a more balanced set of social and institutional supports for better lives. Here are the 10 happiest countries to live in the world for 2024. Many of these countries are seen as the world's safest countries. Number 10. Austria. Austria scored particularly highly in social support and its citizens' freedom and was no doubt helped by its capital, Vienna. Now widely regarded to be the world's most livable city, 73% of Austrians are satisfied with their lives, despite high levels of air pollution and schools that are less than stellar. Maybe the lower-than-average crime rate explains why Austrians feel so good. The Alps cover around 62% of Austria, making it one of the most scenic and extensive skiing destinations. Number 9. Canada Although Canada is still ranked as one of the happiest nations in the world, it did drop two spots from last year. Canada still ranks high across pretty much every category. With great life expectancy, married to a still small population, with more than enough room to spread out and find their own corner of paradise. According to the report, part of Canada's high happiness score also comes from its tolerant approach to multiculturalism via programs that promote inter-ethnic understanding. Number 8. New Zealand. Holding steady once again in the eighth spot, New Zealand remains a relaxed, welcoming wonderland that loses none of its appeal, whether you're on vacation or based there permanently. The people here don't place too much emphasis on work, spend lots of time outside, and aren't overly concerned about personal achievement or status. New Zealand is also known for the beautiful landscapes, outdoor adventure sports, including bungee jumping, jet boating, and skydiving, as well as great climate and good food. Number 7. Sweden Essentially, swapping places with Canada since last year, Sweden has once again benefited from excellent social support and a high life expectancy. The Swedish government lists perks such as long parental leave policies, free schooling and baby-friendly public areas. Healthcare as well as a college education are free and its people boast one of the longest life expectancies in the world. Number 6. Switzerland. It's one of the world's wealthiest countries and has been well known for centuries for its neutrality. Their welfare and healthcare programs are amongst some of the best in the world. The average life expectancy is 83. They are multilingual, with most citizens understanding German, French and English. The Swiss see public transportation as a right. They have a bus system that ensures no one in the country has to walk more than 10 minutes to get to public transportation. Number 5. Netherlands. A country in northwestern Europe, it's known for a flat landscape of canals, tulip fields, windmills, and cycling routes. The country is also renowned for its livability progressiveness and work-life balance. Famously relaxed and welcoming, their particular brand of lifestyle has propelled them to be the fifth happiest country on earth. Pace of life and freedom are particularly strong points that put a smile on many residents' faces. Number four. Iceland, the island nation was rated to be one of the most peaceful nations on earth. Beautiful landscapes that make you feel like you're wandering through middle-earth.b 
Why far the world's most equality-driven country? Tiny Iceland's isolation has been a boon rather than a burden to its equally tiny population. Iceland offers a relatively low income tax, free healthcare, and free higher education to its citizens. Number 3. Norway. Norway is consistently described as Europe's most beautiful country that benefits from little to no corruption, phenomenal social support and freedom, and a regular top spot in the world's prosperity indexes. Norway provides free education, public pensions, and universal health care for its residents, and is widely considered to be an exemplar of social and economic success. People in Norway tend to have a great deal of social support, trust their government, and live a long life. Both the poverty rate and the gender pay gap are amongst the lowest in the world. Two, Denmark. Benefiting from excellent life expectancy and one of the smallest wealth gaps in the world. It's got to have its eye on the top spot for 2020. Denmark is a small country with a low crime rate and a low fear of crime. The Danish are generally well educated and well informed. Denmark has a stable government, low levels of public corruption, and access to high quality education and healthcare. The country does have the highest taxes in the world, but the vast majority of Danes happily pay. They believe higher taxes can create a better society. One, Finland. Finland is one of the most peaceful countries in the world. It has the highest quality of life, the country of about 5.5 million people is home to around 300,000 foreign nations, with its largest immigrant groups being from other European nations. It's the only country in the developed world where fathers spend more time with school-aged children than mothers. In particular, the generosity of its people, with little to no corruption and high GDP married to the extraordinary freedom offered by its landscapes and social structure make it the place to live. And if you can't live there, we highly recommend a visit to these countries. Thanks for watching the video and see you next time.